It's been one year since a local boy was shot in the head at a house party that was advertised on social media. Gunmen fired into the home, striking the teen who was simply enjoying his very first party. DeAndre Yates continues his fight. In honor of his progress, his mother wanted to host a youth event and bring together other moms who lost children to gun violence in the city. Inside this packed gymnasium were a group of people with a few things in common, many of them impacted by gun violence. Others want to be a part of the change to decrease violence in Indianapolis. It was just a vision that I had in order to honor my son's one year of survival. They said he would live three days, and today is the 365th day of his uh, surviving a traumatic brain injury. Out of that vision, this event, Pray for Dre, Play for Dre, became a reality. A 515 youth basketball tournament to bring local families together and honor the survival of the child who was simply in the wrong place at the wrong time. Now 14 years old, DeAndre Knox continues to recover at a rehabilitation hospital in Illinois. He joined the event during an emotional moment via Skype. He is able to hold his head up more. He's feeding himself at least seven to 10 bites without fatiguing out. He's standing with assistance for 30 minutes and holding his head up for 15 minutes. May seem minute to some people, but that's huge for us because they told me it would be a vegetable. Dre's story has especially given hope to mothers whose sons were killed as a result of gun violence. Many of them have come together to lend each other support. We have formed a group called the Mom Survivor Group. And at times throughout the week, I am having a bad day and I know that I can pick up the phone and speak with those ladies. As Dre continues to recover, his mother now has even more support from other moms who want to help families that that know their pain. We can all come together one way or another as surviving moms and we'll make it with the help of each other. Inspiring message there from those ladies. Yates, Ma, uh, Yates says the money raised today will help other families affected by violence.